Good afternoon, my fellow brothers and sisters. I tell you, Satan's trying to destroy everything I'm doing for the Lord, uh, but it's not going to work. He's trying, but he's not going to work. So, anyway, um, today the Lord has told me to pray for those who have sickness and diseases in their bodies. I, before I tell you this, before I pray for you, for those who are lost and unbelievers, your healing will not come. But I tell you, if you come to Christ, your healing will come. Anyways, I wanted to read to you some promises that God has foretold for his people before I prayed for you. Okay. Christ carried our sins in his body on the cross so we would stop living for sin and start living for what is right. And bec and you are healed because of his wounds. 1 Peter 2.24 Psalms 103.3 He forgives us he forgives all my sins and heals my diseases. James 5, 14 and 15. Anyone who's sick should go to the churches, elders. They should pray for the, and pour oil on the person in the name of the Lord. And pray that is said with faith will make the person well. The Lord will heal that person and if the person has sinned their sins will be forgiven the book of Jeremiah states Lord heal me and I will truly be healed save me and I will truly be saved you're the one I praise it's Jeremiah 17:14. Jeremiah goes on to say again I will bring your help and your he and heal your injuries says the Lord and Isaiah 53 5 he was but he was wounded for our wrong for the wrong we did he was cursed crushed for the evil we did the punishment which made us well was given to him and we are healed because of his blood, by his stripes. Proverbs 4, 20 and 22. My child, pay attention to my words. Listen closely to what I say. Don't ever forget my words. Keep them always in mind. They are the key to life for those who find them. They bring health to the whole body. Those are some promises that God has for his chosen people. Anyone who called upon the name of the Lord is chosen. Everyone who called upon the name of the Lord is chosen. Before I pray also, the Lord told me to have them, which is you guys, to place your hand wherever you may be hurting, feeling sick, uh, whatever disease you may have. Place your hand right there. Focus your mind upon God.
and I'm going to stand with you right now, saying to that spirit of infirmity to come out in the name of Yeshua. I plead the blood of Yeshua, the blood that forgives and cleanses us from all sin. I command you to lead this individual. You have no right there. In the name of Yeshua, I command every sickness, every disease to leave in the name of Yeshua. I plead the blood upon this individual's head. I plead the blood upon this individual's nose. I plead the blood of in the individual's eyes. I plead the blood of upon the individual's mouth and ears. I plead the blood upon this individual's skin. I plead the blood of Jesus upon the chest and stomach. I plead the blood of Jesus upon the back of the this individual. I plead the blood of Jesus upon the legs of this individual. I plead the blood over the Need of this individual. I plead the blood upon the shins of this individual. I plead the blood upon the ankles of these individuals. I plead the blood upon the feet of these individuals. I plead the blood upon the arms of the individuals. I plead the blood of the forearms of the individuals. I plead the blood upon the elbows of the individual. I plead the blood in every hand, both hands, every fingers, every ten, all ten fingers, I plead the blood, I plead the blood in the hair of this individual, I plead the blood in the eyebrows of the, in the individual, I plead the blood upon the toes upon this individual, <coughs> I plead the blood upon the calves of these individuals. I plead the blood upon the shoulders of, of these individuals. I plead the blood on the neck of these individuals. We are healed by the name of Yeshua, by his stripes. <coughs> by his stripes we were healed. In the name of the precious blood of Yeshua HaMashiach, the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, if you would like to have the gift, the free gift of salvation through the blood of Yeshua, I ask you to just repeat after me. Father God, I am sorry for all of my sins. I make Jesus Christ my Lord and my Savior, and I believe with all my heart that you have raised Jesus Christ from the dead. I ask you, Jesus, to come into my, to my, into my soul, into my spirit, into my heart. Cleanse me and purify me and sanctify me. Set me apart to, for you. And to use me for your glory. In the name of Yeshua. Amen. If you, if you have prayed this prayer, I want to let you know that welcome. Welcome to the kingdom of God. You will live forever. You will not take part of the second death. If you repent of your sins and go the other way, you have to repent and come close to Jesus. For Jesus Christ is not a religion. He is a friend, a healer, a lawyer. He is 
your banker. He is your everything. He did a relationship. To <clears throat> he is the mediator to the Father. Before I go, I want to give you guys a hug. Welcome to the kingdom of heaven. I love you all. Have a nice day.